Aegon is depicted in one of four statues in the Great Hall of the Red Keep. When Daemon is brought before Viserys sitting on the Iron Throne, he tells his brother that he cuts the image of the Conqueror. When Viserys decides to name his daughter Rhaenyra his heir, he tells her a secret known only by the king and his heir since Aegon's time. It was not ambition that led Aegon to conquer the Seven Kingdoms, but a dragon dream he called, The Song of Ice and Fire. In it, Aegon foresaw the return of the White Walkers and the Great War, and that to counter the threat, a Targaryen must unite and rule Westeros. Demon requests Viserys to wed Rhaenyra, although he is already married, by pointing out that Aegon the Conqueror married two women. Viserys disdainfully declines, commenting that Demon is no conqueror. Viserys shows his daughter a Valyrian steel dagger. He tells that dagger once belonged to Aegon the Conqueror. Before his death, the last of the Valyrian pyromancers hid his song in the steel. Rhaenyra explains Sir Criston Cole that she has duties for the realm, much greater than her personal desires. She mentions that Aegon the Conqueror united the Seven Kingdoms and put them on a path. Regio Horatis, the Prince of Pentos, tells Demon that during the Century of Blood, Aegon joined Pentos against Volantis, rode Beleriand to aid them in Lys and burned a fleet of enemy ships, thus turning the tide. 